All right, going to mix in a 2022 UK edition uh, rip in between the jumbo case I am currently doing. Let's get into it. All right, welcome back. Josh here on the KC Car Connection and going to do a UK edition. I've um, had this actually for a while. I uh, actually had some UK for a while. I'm actually going to finally start putting it into some breaks. It was always kind of my plan because I thought it was a fun, sorry, just miss you over here, E2. Uh, fun, fun product. Um, get so many hits. You can usually get like six, seven, eight hits out of a box. Lots of fun. I still prefer the uh, Japan edition over it, but it's quite a bit more expensive. Uh, so I've had, like I said, I've had some. I have a case. This is just a loose box I picked up recently. Um, you know, a couple weeks ago, one of the early um, Black November sales. Um, but I, I said I've had a case. I have a case. I'm finally getting in to do more breaks. So I think this would be a fun mixer. Uh, throw in because it's uh, you get hits galore and just kind of a cool set and boom right at the bat see you get a sweet bobby uh, pretty cool card kind of rare oh, he's got a little something going on though Not too bad and then yeah we're going to get all kinds of colored cards all numbered 125 or less and a julio same box good start um, but pretty cool so again UK just has the that's 220 cards from the three different flagship sets from 2022 Series 1, 2, and Update. As all the good rookies on their rookie image, plus a bunch of the bigger players. A um, few inserts, and then you can get autos out of these, as we've seen. And uh, we should get about oh, six to seven eight numbered cards in the end but yeah i dig it it's definitely a fun rip especially if you could have got cheap there for a while it was cheap and it goes back up anywhere from 125 to 150 bucks or something like that so future stars and guerrero but yeah i do up on the website kccardbreaks.com a little mixer um, I threw up there. Um, there's actually a couple probably up there at the time. There's a TCU mixer, but the new one is the December mixer number one. It's got a chrome, 23 chrome hobby, a hobby box of this, and then also a 23 tier one, a holiday of uh, 22 and 23, and also a Topps chrome. Uh, platinum blaster from 22. All right, ooh, first number card to black, so that means it will be at a 125. Uh, but anyways, yeah, so it's also a 15 spot break, so each spot will get two team, two random teams. Doing a little bit different. Who we got? Who we got? Liam Hendricks, 23 comeback player of the year. So first number card again. These are at a 125, 37, 125, the lowest. I say lowest, but like the lowest parallel, I guess, um, out of here is that at a 125. Then the next one will be the Ben Baller. Not the Ben Baller, the Big Ben. Big Ben, which is a red parallel with um, little outlines of Big Ben on it. And that's the 99, and then you go down from there. But anyways, yeah, help the channel out. Um, support the channel, getting those breaks. Just It really does just help the channel. Um Helps with content. This helps, you know, helps the financials. It ain't cheap doing all these rips. and But they're fun. I love doing the breaks. A lot of work. Uh, almost kind of stressful all the time getting them together and selling them. But it's still fun. I like it. I'm getting a little better at it. And just, I know people like to get in them. I like getting breaks. I still get in plenty of breaks. It's a cool card. I don't know if I've seen that one. Like this, the, it's all the empty seats. It look cool how it is. But probably staying in Kaufman. Playing in Kaufman. Um, all right so one number card so far it's it i think you can i think there was a box this i opened at one point where you did i did get um i think just like five numbered cards but it does seem like normally you're getting quite a few it's pretty sweet 
which does make it a fun rip and a fun thing to add to a break. But plus, like all these cards on the break, I'd ship every card, even though they're just base, but they're the cool cards um, with that. So that, again, nice torque. You know, it's pretty cool to get a torque. But you know, you get your favorite player, and it has the little UK symbol on there. I think it's cool. Gold Schmidt. So that was the MVP card last uh, year, but of course it would have had to be Chrome. All right, well we're going slow with the hits. We're going kind of slow, uh, and uh, maybe get a sneak an auto as well. But I definitely dig this, but. To me, the Japan edition is superior. It's just cool, cool looking product. Um, and Japan has a little bit more of a history of baseball, you know, a little bit more into it. So I think that makes it a little cooler as well for me. Um, as you can see, the Shohei's up there. I got them both from the Japan edition on tens, just the base cards. Man, what's up with these flippies? Flippy, flip, flip. So dope. Although I do like this insert, it's pretty cool. They don't have that in this one. This is specific to UK, but again, what makes the also Japan better? It has the '87 um, inserts, and it's on a cherry tree pattern. And then you can get those numbered. If you saw my latest PSA preview, uh, submission preview, I had an Eric Judge in there. It was a gold one of those. Pretty sweet looking card. Why I do dig those, but they're, they're quite a bit more expensive. And they're harder to get. You have to pretty much got to get those from eBay, and they get, all get shipped from Japan. All right, we got a purple in here. I, th I want to say purples are out of seventy-five. And also, a little PSA: if you do rip one of these for yourself, or you have a channel, and you don't want to ruin your hits, the hits are always on the back. So if you open it with the you know on the back of the pack, you will see the hit and ruin it. All right, red, red got his arm in the air Alec Bohm future stars yeah out of 50 out of 50 okay then maybe the golds are out of 25 because I know then this one um, there was a blue color it's not royal blue it's not the Father's Day blue it's a kind of in-between blue and that's out of 75 it's the jade green of the Japan edition is out of 75 and I think yeah gold must be the one out of out of 50 which gold is usually out of I mean out of 25 it's normally gold is out of 50 and they just kind of switched it up a little bit there's your wander Brandon Donovan he's another good rookie from update heater so all right maybe this last stack is gonna have all the parallels in it oh so there we go so I did it of course this one is just an insert not a numbered card it's easy to do that when you rip those packs. It just kind of lends itself to doing it that way. Pujols, cool card. Shohei. Again, so the Shohei with the Japan flag on there is far superior. Pete Alonzo. And then they have a specific insert to Japan. Pretty cool. Uh, or the Shohei, where it's all just Shohei cards on the insert. Ooh, so we got a it's either a red or, or a big Ben red. It looks like a big Ben. I can see a little white, a little white on it. All right, here we go. This is at 99. All right, come on, big rookie. What kind of oh, the orange? Trey Mancini. Like I said, yeah. So this one should be at 99, 91 of 99. You kind of can see the pattern on there. All right, numbered card number three. So the goal is at least six. I think we should hopefully just get the six. That's what we're looking for. All right, we got a black. So another black. We're starting to roll into the numbered cards. Which way are we going? This way. Trey Turner. That's a cool card. Nice black Trey Turner. There's also Jerry Payne, your rookie. We'll throw him down there. That was actually in pretty good shape, too. Ten. Of buck twenty-five. I think the red. I think it's it's either a ten or five. It's one of those two. I think it's out of five, but it could be out of ten. Raphael Devers. 
So if you haven't been watching the jumbo case uh, rips, go check it out. Um, I will be doing that, and then also uh, we'll be doing a hobby case after that to continue the rip, and then doing fun stuff with those boxes, a little different. So go check it out, see what we're doing. Just change up a little bit, having a little fun with the boxes. All right, so here, I don't want to, I don't want to look the back to ruin the hit. If there is a hit. There's not, but it's how sometimes you see you just start ripping it and you're talking and then you see all of a sudden you see oh well there's a numbered card and I saw who it was. It's just not as fun. I mean if you're ripping at home, it could still be fun. I think even though when I was when I rip when I was ripping off camera and I'd still rip off camera, it's still fun to not just go straight to the hit, you know. I mean, just like leave it where it's at in the pack and be like mm. it's still fun. All right, so we got a gold. So this one should be at 25. All right. Uh, yeah. The yellow. So it should so also, right? So O'Neill Cruz should be in here. So we could get a O'Neill Cruz. No. Kevin Smith. That's a sick looking card, though. That gold color. I like that a lot, actually. It looks Dude, that'd be sick on a Bobby. But that is a nice looking gold. Like, it's... I don't know how to describe it. I like it better than the other gold. Um, this one looks really sweet. So 10 of 25 on Alex or Kevin Smith. Alex Smith. Um, yeah, I don't know why, but that, that gold just has a nice muted mm, gold to it. Looks good. Unfortunately, it's Kevin Smith. Yeah, all these. I would have switched, the, as of now, the Trey Turner. Put him on a gold. All right. So that is a numbered card, a numero five. And there's only a Cruz. Again, a cool thing about these sets is that it has all the rookies from 22 on there. Um, like the base rookies. You're going to see Strider in here, obviously Wander. All the guys, you know, all of them from Series 1 and 2 are in here with update guys as well. Obviously, here on this channel, I do a lot of updates as we're hunting for, but you just kind of have a, big, a good variety of good rookies you can get on parallels um, in this set. And it's like their true rookie, per se. I mean, it's obviously not the flagship, but it is because it's the their uh, their rookie card just with the UK image on it. So I think it's pretty cool. It's like Nick Lodolo, which he's obviously an update as well. Pete. Thomas and Pujols. All right, one more pack. And we're going to get one more numbered card. Get us a six. I said normally it's about six to get up to. Yes, sir. We got number six coming in. It's be the blue. So this is um, so the purple and gold and red are both in Japan and UK. But the black is only in UK. There is no out of 125 in Japan. And then this blue is specific to um, UK as well as like that is specific to UK where it's a cherry blossom on the UK. I'm mean, sorry, the Japan. All right, come on. This would be a sweet Bobby too with this blue color. It's red. Red, red doesn't do me any good. Spencer Strider. The Braves have a red border. Oh, yeah, Braves. Dansby Swanson, uh, but again, I really do, even like this blue, is a really cool blue, it's kind of, like got a nice color to it, like it's just a, just the finish of it, it's really nice, so Dansby Swanson, that is 75, 16, 18, 16, uh, but yeah, that's kind of what you can expect out of these, you get uh, about five, I mean, sorry, about, use about six numbered cards, sometimes seven, eight, uh, I know I've gotten up to eight, uh, like with a numbered autograph in there, um, I think even one box I did, I had nine parallels. Um, so pretty cool. Um, but yeah, uh, I'll have one of these in a break coming up in the mixer break, along with some other uh, fun boxes. Uh, if you're interested, go check out the website, KC Card Breaks. And until next time, see you.